so it's our next question which is from the fluid mechanics and the fluid power engineer so here for we find uh, mass density weight density and specific volume so first of all uh, there is a formula for a, a finite pressure increase which is dp y minus dv yv is equal to dp y d rho y rho it it is uh, actually bulk modulus so now dp is equal to uh, which is given it d to uh, minus eight, zero because uh, we find difference so 82 minus is equal to 82 and it, uh, it is uh, now we convert it into newton per meter square so for newton we multiply 10 to the power 6 for convert so mm, bulk modulus is given which is 2350 megapascal so for convert megapascal into newton per meter square we multiply it by 10 to the power 6 and uh, increase in density is equal to d rho y rho dp yk so here we put the value which is given so a rho is equal to so we put these values from the from above so now the outcome is 35.76 kg per meter cube so now they were at a depth of 8 km from the surface uh, now we find mass density ok so from the above uh, mass density is equal to means uh, we find rho so it is actually density plus uh, increase in density which is we find L so it is uh, equal to actually 1025 is density which is uh, given or uh, is 3576 uh, it is a uh, increase in density okay so uh, we add this and after adding it is comes 1060.76 kilogram per meter cube okay so after that we find mass or uh, weight density actually it is weight density is a specific weight so it is uh, uh, is this like weight so it is equal to rho g rho is equal to density this is equal to gravitational but like gravity uh, rho we take uh, from ever which is 1060.76 and z is equal to 9.81 after multiply it it is come 14 one zero four zero six newton per meter cube now oh, we find a specific volume okay so we know that v is equal to one by rho so rho we also find it so it is uh, one zero six zero point seven six so after divide one by so it's come 0 0.000943 meter cube per kilogram it is the final answer so thank you please and subscribe my channel